Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today, we are sharing a new Town Hall 13 hybrid base design with you. So let's talk about the base design. Since it is a hybrid base, so you can use the space to protect your both trophies and loot in the higher league like Champion League. On these leagues this base can hold pretty much every Town Hall 13 attacking strategies including Electro Dragon Spam and Becca Smash. Because we designed this base in such a way that it can prevent both ground and air attack strategy from getting 3 stars from this base. Even max Town Hall 14 players cannot get 3 stars from this base. In this base, we placed Clan Castle in the center of the base, which means opponent cannot lure CC troops at the beginning of attack which will act as a strong defense later in the battle. And for the CC troops we suggest to use 2 super minions, 3 headhunters and rest is archers. And we placed both Eagle Artillery and Town Hall far from each other, so that if the opponent attack from the Town Hall side, they cannot reach Eagle Artillery easily. Which will create difficulty in achieving second or third stars. And if opponents start their attack from Eagle Artillery side, they will not have enough troops and spell in order to destroy the Town Hall. In addition to that, we distributed all the main defenses in such a way that they can provide both ground and air coverage all over the base, and we set all the Inferno Towers on single target, so it can eliminate tanking troops and heroes quickly while they reach near to core part of the base. And we set all the Expo on ground target, so it can target heroes during the air attack strategies without any distraction, which will force opponent to use their hero's ability early in the battle. Also it can cover longer range and ground target, which is already beneficial during ground attacking strategy. And we placed Tesla farm near to Expos, so that it could protect Expos from merit troops. Also, we placed all heroes near to these main defenses, so that they can distract opponent's troops while they reach near to main defenses, which will buy us some extra time to eliminate opponent's troops. And since Inferno Tower is guarding the core part, so we placed all the air defenses on the outer compartments, so that both Inferno Tower and air defense can provide their coverage all over the base. Also Lightning Spell cannot damage these two main defenses at once, since they are placed far from each other. Also both air sweepers are placed in the inner compartment facing toward Town Hall and Eagle Artillery, which will create difficulty for opponent during air attack strategies whether they start their attack either from Town Hall or Eagle Artillery. Also we placed all the air traps near to these main defenses, which will help to eliminate opponent's air troops quicker. Also to prevent ground attacking strategies, we placed all the defensive buildings that can deal splash damage on opponent's troops along with giant bombs all over the base, which will make them to use their spell frequently in order to save their troops like Bullers, Hog Riders and Yeti. And when they use their spell sooner and frequently, they cannot get full 3 stars from the space. Also we placed all the spring traps between the defenses, which will be beneficial during the hog rider attack strategies. And we placed all the archer towers, cannons and mortars on the edge of the base, so that they can provide ground and air coverage on the outer part of the base. And we placed all the storage buildings far from each other into the different compartments, so that opponent cannot get all loot unless they destroy the space, and it is guarded with pretty much every defensive building. So, if you like this base design, give us a like on this video and share it with your friends, and also subscribe to our channel for more upcoming greatest base designs. Also we will show you the defense coverage of every defensive buildings and defense replay of the space design later in this video, so that you can know how effective the space design is. So, see you in the defense replay part of this video. Once again, let's see the placement of the defensive structures and heroes, and its effective coverage, also you can copy this space design from the link in the description.
let's see some defense replays so that you can know how effective the space design is. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit that like button and share it with your friends. And if you are not subscribed to our channel yet, then hit that red subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. And if you need more base layout at different town hall levels, make sure to mention in the comment section. And I will see you in the next one.